Greg Smith. Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. The United Kingdom has a vibrant classic car sector, but the DVLA seems to have taken against them somewhat, forcing cars that have had modest repairs onto Q plates or even for heinous crimes such as fitting seat belts. From attending the HGVA's Heritage Matters Day during Easter recess and from my own inbox, the problems do seem to be getting worse. I've raised this in the Transport Select Committee numerous times, but the problem isn't going away. So can we have a debate in government time to iron out these issues and ensure the Department for Transport gets a grip on the DPLA's attitude to the classic car sector? Well, I would be very happy to raise what the Honourable Gentleman says with the uh, Transport Secretary, as Transport Questions is not until the uh, 16th of May. But this is also a matter for an enormous number of UK businesses. Uh, this is not just about people's um, own personal vehicles. There is an enormous uh, export market here, and uh, of course, um, British motorsport and uh, motoring is something that the uh, that Britain is very much known for. So this is, a, this is a very important matter, and I congratulate the Honourable Gentleman for campaigning on it, and I will make sure that all relevant Secretaries of State have heard what he has said.